Hello, hello everybody. This is Moni with Flowers by the Bunch. I hope you are having a wonderful day. Today we are going to make a, a <laughs> my mouth won't work. We are going to make a wrist corsage, but it's going to be out of artificial glues. So instead of using um, the cold glue, Oasis glue, we're gonna just use our hot glue pan. This is an elastic um, wristband. I have got this little contraption that we made out of PVC pipe. We made it so that it would make it easy to glue corsages. So I've slipped my wristband right onto my PVC. I'm gonna take, this is just a bamboo skewer, and I'm gonna dip it right into my hot glue. And actually, I'm gonna wait just a second. I'm gonna tie my bow first because if I dip it in my hot glue, it's gonna dry before I get my bow made. So we're gonna start out by making a quick bow. I like to have my bow um, placed before I place my, um, my flowers. And so I'm gonna tie a bow. What we're gonna do is I've got two different ribbons. I've got a sheer ribbon and then I've got one that's a little, um, a little more um, solid. So I'm gonna start out with my shear, and I'm holding the ribbon between my um, thumb and forefinger, and I'm just gonna make a loop, and I'm gonna twist, a loop, twist, a loop, twist, a loop, twist. I'm gonna cut it and leave some, some streamers, and I have some plentiful scissors. There we go. And then I'm gonna layer my ribbon. I'm gonna add the solid ribbon right on the back, and I'm just putting it right over, right under my pointer finger and my, under my thumb. And I'm going to make the same amount of loops. I'm gonna make two loops on each side. So we're gonna have four loops on each side of this bow. Leave a streamer. So there's my bow. I'm gonna take a piece of florist wire and I'm gonna slide that right up underneath my thumb. So I'm just holding it right up underneath and I'm going to bend it down. And I've got that wire between my pointer and my middle finger. I'm gonna put this finger in and I'm pushing and I'm doing a twist. Now what that finger does is it pushes it tight so that that um, ribbon is tied tight. And then I'm just gonna fluff my bow. Just like that, okay? I'm gonna take some wire snips and I'm gonna snip that ribbon, I mean that wire, right off. I'm gonna bend that wire down. Okay, so we have our bow ready. So next what I'm going to do is I'm gonna add some glue right here to the top of my um, wristlet. And I just dipped my bamboo skewer right into the hot glue and I'm just adding a dollop of hot glue right to that wristlet, okay? And then you can use a hot glue gun if you want to. I just happen to have my glue pan and my glue pan just makes it so easy. And then I laid my bow right into that glue. The wonderful thing about hot glue is it's quick. It dries quickly and it holds fast. Next, what I'm going to do is my client, my customer, brought in her own artificial flowers that she wanted to use. So she brought in this beautiful stem of orchids. So we're gonna use just a few of the smaller blooms at the top, and I'm going to take my scissors and just snip off several of those blooms and that bud. I'll lay that stem to the side. So here are my blooms cut off, okay? So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna start with my larger bloom first, and I am just going to take it, I'm gonna cut this stem kind of flush like that. I'm gonna add just a dollop of hot glue to the back of that bloom. And I'm gonna glue it right into that ribbon. Okay. So I just glued it right down into that ribbon. I'm gonna take my 
my next balloon. And I may not need the third. We're gonna play it. I'm just gonna take it. I'm leaving this little stem on the flower, dipping it right into that hot glue. I'm gonna tuck it right down in to that ribbon, just like that. Now we have this cute little bud, just a little green bud. I dip it in glue. And just glue it right down into that little corsage. I'm gonna hold that just a second because I want it to stay. Are you gonna stay, you little heavy guy? He's a little heavy. We're hoping he'll stay. Okay, next I have some pretty little foliage. I don't know, let's see, do we need this guy? I don't think we really need the third one, so I'm gonna set it to the side, we might. Now I have this little foliage. This is just a little garland that we've cut off of. This is a pretty little dainty, foliage so I'm going to use it. What I'm going to do is just take and cut a few of the little little stems just like that. I'm going to dip these in the glue just like I did the flowers. Just dip those right down into that glue and just tuck it right into the ribbon. Yeah. And just tuck it right into that ribbon. So you can see how easy this is. Honestly, artificial is so much easier than fresh. And the reason it is, is because hot glue dries so quickly. Um, cold glue takes a minute to adhere, and so it just takes time to wait. You have to wait with cold glue. And with hot glue, you don't. It just, it just glues it, <laughs> and it stays in place. So I've just taken each little stem of greenery, popping it with a little glue. I'm gonna cut off a few more little sprigs. Dip it in that glue. And tuck it right in. You just keep layering until you're happy. You know, you can do it as large or as small as you'd like. Now, I do think that I want to add this other balloon. So I'm gonna take it and trim up this little stem. I'm gonna dip it in the glue. And then I'm gonna lift this balloon here tuck it right in. All right. And there we have it. There's our little wrist corsage. So she'll just be able to, we'll drop it in and put it in a pretty box, a pretty presentation box. But there you go. There's a artificial orchid wrist corsage. Guys, thank you so much for being here this afternoon. I hope you have a wonderful day. Please be sure to subscribe to our channel so that you can see more videos like this. Thanks, guys. See you real soon.